In this video, I'm going to show you how to easily share your Animoto video slideshows with friends or family or students or whoever you're making these videos with in your class. So I'm already logged into Animoto, animoto.com. And the easiest way to get to your videos right from the home page is at the top right. After you log in, you can click on my videos and it takes you to your video manager. Now, one thing I didn't point out before is that with the iPhone or the iPad app, there's a separate video list for those videos made on a mobile device. And when you click on this, it takes you to that page. I don't have the app downloaded because I don't use iDevices. I actually use Android, uh, but they, they list right here in this separate file. So just be aware of that if you're using the app to create these videos. Now, there's two ways to share. When you mouse over a video title, there's the actions button that pops up on the right. So if we click on this, we can download, share, export, do whatever right from the video manager. So if you know which video you're using, then you can, I, I would suggest doing it right from here. Uh, we can download it as an MP4 file so it plays a video on your computer. We can share it, we can export it. it uh, so let me show you the sharing options. When you click on share, it takes you to this page. And what this has is it's got mainly Facebook integration. Remember, we can log into Animoto with our Facebook account. And so what they try and do is they try and make that as seamless as possible. So I could just take this and share it with a friend. I could type in a friend's name here and share it right to their wall. I could post it to my wall, just like you would share a video that you found on YouTube to your Facebook wall. There's also integration with Twitter, with Blogger, Posturus, if you're using Posturus, uh, with a Tumblr, and then they've got even more services, I mean, uh, dozens to choose from that you can go through and you can choose which ones you wanna share with. But the, the big ones are linked right here on the Animoto website. We can also share the link. So if you click on share a link, uh, it gives you the link and you would just take this and you could either just click on copy or you could right click and copy it to your clipboard to put into an email or just to save you from opening another window, you would click on email the link and the box opens up that gives you an option to put in an email address to send to with a message and then you would click on share the video. So that's one way to, to share your videos from Animoto. The other way to do it, so it's taken me right to the video file right here, but let me show you how to do it. So if we go back to my videos, so again, here's my video manager. I would click on the video title itself to get to the video page. And all of the sharing options are linked from the top. So one thing that's on here that wasn't on the previous screen is the Pinterest button. So if you're using Pinterest boards with your students or with friends or family, you can click on pin it and it will pin it to your Pinterest board. We can like it to Facebook. We can also Facebook it here or Twitter, tweet it here to Twitter. There's an email button and then there's more sharing here. So we can copy the link. It also gives you an embed code. So if I click on embed, and I've shown you this with YouTube and Vimeo before, but we get all this HTML code and you don't need to know anything about it to use it. All you would do is copy it to your clipboard. And then if you're using a Google site or uh, a Tumblr, and I'm, I use WordPress, so I'll paste my code here and I'll update my page and I'll show you what it looks like when it's embedded. So we'll view the page. Uh, so here are the videos. Here's my YouTube video that I've embedded. Here's my Vimeo video that we embedded. And now here's the Animoto video that was embedded on the site. So again, and you can click and you can play it straight from the website that you're showing to students or with family or friends. So sharing in Animoto is very simple to do and it's just as integrated as any other video service we've used before. But so from your video page, it's all in the top right. If you're on your video manager, all of the sharing functions are found in the actions button right here.